This video is sponsored by Casetify. Yo, 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 what's going on, man? First of all, happy iPhone day, all right? For all my iPhone people that's out there, man, happy iPhone day. I'm pretty sure you're waiting on your delivery truck or you did like I did and went up in the store and picked it up, man. By the way, I'm probably never doing delivery again. In-store pickup was just entirely too smooth. So let's go ahead and get into it, man. As you can see in front of me, you know I had to go big boy, man. 13 Pro Max 256 gig in the gold color. Now, I have not had a gold iPhone in a while, in a very long time. I'm usually a born graphite person. I was hoping it was going to give us matte black, but we didn't get it. Sierra blue is a dope looking color. I saw it when I went to the Apple store. Very clean looking color, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to go a little bit classy this year, and I'm going to switch it up, and I'm going to go with the gold. So, Let's go ahead and get into it, man. Black box this year with the iPhone facing backwards. You know, last year the screen was facing, but now they turned it down. You know, you know it is what it is. Pull tabs this year, all right? We got no more plastic. The plastic is gone, man. I don't know how I feel about it, but, you know, it is what it is. Classic Apple stuff sometimes is kind of hard to hard to get rid of, but we got the little pull tab. So we're just going to do it, do it like that real quick. Let's go ahead and flip it over. And let's... Boom. All right. Let's slide that there. Now, I do want to compare the gold. I know my girl has the gold 12 Pro Max. This is the 13 Pro Max. And I do want to compare the golds and see how they look because I've heard some people say on video that these are different, but I also heard some people say they're the exact same, but I think they're different and it's just the way the light hits it. All right. We don't got to go over what's in the box. We already know and people still complain about it, but it is what it is. It's 2021. They don't give us any charges. Get over it. You know what I mean? It's just, it's just what it is at this point. So let's go ahead and take it off. I don't have the little ASMR thing, man. I don't really get involved with all that, but here it is, man. The gold 12 up. Oh, see, I'm already saying 12 Pro Max. It always takes me a few weeks to say 13, you know what I mean? But here it is, man. This is going to be the gold 13 Pro Max. Nice. This is a, I can tell right away for me that the gold is different. Just by looking at my girl's 12 Pro Max and just remembering how it looks, it definitely looks a little bit different. I can say that. Those cameras definitely are big. And that's one thing that I'm looking forward to, man, to see if they really had some true camera improvements, just not in low light, but in regular light as well. I want to see if it actually is a little bit better, but cameras are definitely big. Go, And I'm kind of enamoring, I guess that might be a word, <laughs> over this gold because I have not had a gold iPhone in such a long time. All right. So that's why I'm kind of really looking over this and, and just checking it out. But it's nothing much different, man. It is It is nothing different. This is probably going to be the very first time that you uh, will see this thing as clean because I just really wish Apple would get rid of these. It's pretty. It's nice to look at. But gosh, I wish they would get rid of those shiny bezels because I just I can't stand them. I wish they would just go matte. Just give us matte so everything can be nice and clean. But let's go ahead and power it on real quick. And while we're waiting for the power on, man, I know I know you guys out there are waiting to see some type of protection for this thing, man. And, 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 and in saying that, let me go ahead and tell you a little bit about today's sponsor, and that's going to be Casetify. Now, chances are, if you're watching this video, you're probably upgrading from the 10, 11, 12 series, and you got those old phone cases just sitting now that you can't do nothing with, and you're probably just going to toss them in the trash can. But before you do, I suggest checking out Casetify with their re Casetify program. Now, what that does is they take all of those old cases, they recycle them, use the plastic, and produce some dope cases. And the cases that you see in front of us right here, and this is going to be the Casetify Crush Series. Now, when it comes to the Crush Series, these cases are made out of 65% recyclable and plant based materials. Now, with the re Casetify program, even with them being able to process the plastic the way they do, it helped Casetify decrease its carbon footprint by 20%. Now, in the Crush Series, they are including a new and improved Chi Tech 2.0 that's giving you those drop rates that we love to know when it comes to Casetify Impact Series 6.6. .6, Ultra Impact Series 9.8 feet of drop protection. And as well with Casetify cases, they're going to be 100% BPA free, 100% non-hazardous, non-toxic, and giving you that defensive fight that's going to block 99% of bacteria and microbes. Now, of course, with these cases, it's always going to give you that classic thing that we love about these cases. Nice lay on tear protection, sturdy, nice snug fit that goes all the way around. And just with the customization when it comes to these cases is second to none. Probably some of the most customizable cases out there on the market. So if you want to pick yourself up one of these cases, you already know, check out the link down below, www.casefy.com backslash technically T for 15% off of your brand new iPhone 13 case. 
let's go ahead and get back to the video. All right, so picking the iPhone up here, as you can see, you are greeted with that new screen. Now, the first thing that I do want to test out is how does that 120 hertz feel? Because Apple users rejoice. We finally got that 120 hertz, and I want to see how it feels. Let's see if I can feel it right away. Now, let me see if I can, uh, yeah. I can feel it. It's not as drastic as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be a little bit more drastic because one thing about iOS, it's already smooth as it is. You see what I'm saying? So even with the 120 hertz on the iOS system, 60 hertz was already feeling pretty smooth. But when you go through this, you can definitely kind of see what's going on when it comes to the 120 hertz. But once again, that's something that we're probably going to be having to really test out once we get this bad boy set up and everything like that. And of course, we're going to talk a little bit about the cameras. We're definitely going to get into that battery life because I'm really anxious to see how amazing this battery life is because I've been seeing some ridiculous claims online and I hope it's true. And just whatever else when it comes to iPhone, you already know tons and tons of accessory videos to come as well when it comes to the iPhone. So I just kind of want to do a quick unboxing. And then I also just want to do a little, little quick little little swipe test just to see how that 120 hertz feels but yeah it's iphone season man so once again for everybody that wants to see it here is going to be that gold and the, the bezels with the fingerprints all on it love that black face when it comes to that gold but yeah here it is man gold 13 pro max so as always, man, make sure you guys do the YouTube things. Hit that sub button. Comment down below. Let me know what iPhone you got on release day. And um, let me know what you're looking forward to the most when it comes to the iPhone. Which one of the new features that you want to see the most and that one you plan on enjoying. So do the YouTube things, man. Comment, subscribe, turn the notification bell on, man, so you don't miss out on any of these future videos coming on the 13 Pro Max. But until then, everyone be safe. Catch you on the next one. Later.